He's still got one more to go, but Paul Woods is heading right back to the start line as he's gonna face Josiah Papel in our third place match. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the bronze medal race. The great contest to see who gets on the podium and who stays on the ground. To my right, in the blue lane, from Morristown, New Jersey, representing Sen City, Josiah Pippel. And to my left, in the blue lane, from Wellesley, Massachusetts, representing Vitality Fitness, Paul Woods. Good luck, gentlemen. May the best man win. And both of these athletes were pretty close in the closed qualifier as well. We know that this is going to be a great race. There is a bronze medal on the line for the winner, and here we go. So Josiah once again using the back of the net, Paul the front. Wow, interesting. Paul able to pull ahead there. Josiah right behind, gets a good swing, and takes a slight lead and immediately into the boardwalk. Well, this is Josiah's last run of the weekend. It is time to see what he's been holding in the tank this whole time. I mean, both these men must be tired at this point. Yeah, but you can't leave a single percent of energy on the course. You've got to put it all to use here. And Josiah, very little rest before the zigzag, immediately goes into it. No rest for Paul. Josiah definitely trying to get to the monster swing first after his fall last time. And he has a, a pretty sizable lead over Paul. Exactly right. And now shaking out, Paul doing the same and chalking up. Yeah, the big question now is gonna be how much rest are these men going to use? You're allotted a maximum of 45 seconds, but even if Josiah uh, uses the full 45, that's gonna put Paul in a position and he's not even gonna wait. I think this is smart for Paul. He has energy left in the tank, so he's going to put it to use here. Josiah, no. the six-footer. Paul, the eight-footer. Got it. Oh, wow. Same yeah, with Josiah, through. just catching it. And now it's going to come down to the rope. We have a climb off for bronze, folks. Paul was there about two seconds quicker. Josiah using that patented sliding technique and now employing the same climb that Paul's been doing. Josiah has his legs wrapped more around the rope than Paul does. Uh-oh, Paul, Paul, Paul lost grip of his legs, and that's going to give Josiah an advantage. Josiah is now, I would say, a full body length. Oh, but ahead. he's starting to run out of gas. Oh, my. This vertical section can take so much out. It's... And here comes Paul Woods. Oh, man, this is a race to the finish. Anyone can still win this, but Josiah inching ever so close. He's got to keep his legs on. He's only one pull away, I think. Oh, but this... here's Paul Woods, two pulls away. Oh, God, this is this The is buzzer in sight. This is... It's going to be a race for the final pull. Who, who can reach first? Josiah. With, with this the... foot. With this foot. Hits the buzzer first. Oh, my. What a finish. What a finish, 214 for Josiah That's Pipple. That's why this is the greatest competition in the world. That's why this is the greatest competition in the world. Will, that was incredible. I mean, 214, wow. the second fastest time. He was completely spent and then hits the buzzer with his foot, beating out Paul Woods by about nine seconds. I think. I mean, the crowd reaction says it all. That was a race. It was, a, it was just a, just reaching to the end. I think Josiah knew he didn't have much arm strength left, so just use your feet. Why not? I saw him try that out. I didn't think he would actually do it in the competition, and he does it in his last run of the weekend when the stakes were the highest. Man, I... That was, that was third place. That's the crazy thing. If, we still... if, if the gold medal race is as good as that race, we are in for a treat, and we might be so excited that we're in the water by the time it's over. Oh, man, who knows? Mm -hmm.